Oh my God! Hi! Hello? Oh hi! hi. Oh say hi, guys! God. Oh, oh. oh uh, Anna, say hi to everybody! <laughs> okay, oh. back to reality. What's up? We're going fishing. Woo. Wait. First, we're going where? Snappy's. Snappy's Sports Center. Triple S. Yeah, the smoke is super bad. The smoke? Yeah. Yeah, the smoke has returned. We got rid of the smoke for a couple days. Well, we didn't. Mother Nature did. Blew it out of here. Fine. Smoke. We don't care. So we're going to Snappy's Sports Center. Triple S. Center with an S. That's correct. And we're going to get some fish and stuff. And we're going to the Flathead River. Whoa, crazy biker. That's a hell's daisy. What? <laughs> How do you know everything Snappy, in Montana? Happy Sports that Center, Triple S, Daisy. Hell you got Hell's Angels and you have Hell's Daisies. That that we just seen come through here was a Hell's Daisy. Not quite as intimidating, but nonetheless. Don't mess with them, guys. You know what I mean? I don't understand the difference. Oh, your goggles? Uh -huh. Your goggles are still good. Wait, it doesn't. They're just even, in mom's car. It doesn't even have a strap hmm? to put the, the goggles on. You just have to. They better. The thing was like 50 bucks. Yeah, they don't. Mmm. I'm at the snorkel. Can I try we one? got some. Uh, we got a snorkel. Okay. It has a piece of coconut in it. It does. Mine was lemon. It's so good. Oh. Mmm. Mm, that is really good. Supposedly you can see really good underwater with that. And it has a, a one-way valve so no water can get in if you try to take a breath underwater. Which I always do and I always suck in a whole bunch of lake water. A river water. Was that Every time. That was 50 bucks. Why? Oh, Snappy Sports Center Triple S got me again. Mm, okay. We got about a four minute drive to the river. Okay, we should be done. See the smoke in the trees, eh? walk right to the island I think. What is that yellow rope over there? Where is that steep I don't ground? know what that yellow oh did somebody make a rope swing? I think someone made a rope swing. What? So cool. Anna say hi to all your fans. Hi. Hi this is Anna Marie. She's so shy but she wants to be on YouTube so bad. Mm -mm. <laughs> no. I I really don't care. You know, this is fun. This is fun for a goof, you know. That's Maybe illegal. Like do that. What? That, that. Is it illegal oh, to what? Is the bag now. To graffiti? Yeah. Yes. Destruction or Dad. defacing. What does that even say? S L Yeah, you know. You could sit here and wonder what all of that means, but you'll never figure it out. Can you please take the part? Oh yeah, here. Okay, let's roll. Down to the river's edge. I'm going down, going down this way. Yeah. Oh, I got my fanny pack, Nike sandals Wait, on. Go Not gonna be good. It is steep right here. Oh yeah. Oh my God, that's like a wheeze. I'm doing that's like it. A Hey, there's a Christmas ornament. What? Can I throw this stuff down there, Dad? No, don't throw anything. Hey, it got Just, better. Just, you know, one step at a time. Oh, it got better at least. One step at a time there, or just... Oh, wow. I meant to do that. I don't want to fall. I hate falling. 
Oh, oh yeah. It's all right, baby. I just don't want you to get hurt. If you gotta throw some stuff down here, that's fine. It's just the pancake. Here, let me get the tackle box. Except the tackle box, don't throw that. <laughs> fishing poles. Let's get rigged up here and start fishing. I know, I can touch. Okay, I'm gonna go. Gavin got a fish. You did? Yeah. Let's see what we got here, big dog. Oh my god. Oh, it's a little rainbow. Rainbow. Can I hold hey, Arn, will you bring this stringer? Yeah, here. you can hold it. One second, guys. Can you get this stringer? Oh my god, that's a large. Yeah. Ow. That's how I see it. They are very aggressive. Yeah. Let me see. Oh, he's a puppy. That's our first fish of the day. I've been here for like three hours. Super aggressive. Careful, baby. They're, they're uh, feisty. Lower. Okay, stringer. Let me show you. Summertime and the living's easy. He's still alive. Yeah, he's still alive. String him up. We want him wisely. Yeah, we want to eat him. I've been dying for some rainbow trout. What you fishing with, buddy? I'm fishing with a. Oh, you green got the. Uh, you had a bite with this right off the bat, right? Yeah. We've got the. Green, blue, fox. blue fox number two, super fibrex, with a green tail. It usually works. These blue fox lures, that's man, I've had so much luck with them over the years. I've caught a lot of fish with blue fox. Here you go. Ooh. Don't want any crawdads to get in here. You eating a crawdad in? But so this just happened. A group of kayakers and tubers came by here. I wish I had my GoPro mounted on my head. Hey, but I'm stuck on something. That log out there, one of the kayakers, kind of a bigger guy, that log flipped his kayak over and he went in the water and all his stuff went in the water and the river was taking him under. He grabbed his kayak and we had to run down the river and eventually grab his paddle and help him kind of get into shore. But he didn't have a life jacket on. He obviously didn't know how to swim. He's out here on a kayak. There was beers floating in the river from when his kayak turned over. Like bad combination, dude. If he would have lost his kayak, he grabbed his kayak thankfully and was able to like float it until the river floated him and the kayak to shore. But if he would have lost his kayak, I mean, would I have had to go out there and try to rescue him when he went under? I'm not a great swimmer, but man, come on, people. 
Be prepared. No life jacket. Just blows my mind. He's on the Flathead River in a kayak. What's up? I just broke away from the family. No one wanted to come fishing with me. Everybody's tired. We spent the day at the Cowspell Fair. And they had the carnival rides there and all the junk food vendors. And we did it all, man. We got all, all the wristbands and did all the rides and ate all the junk food. And we just got home a little bit ago. Uh, no one wanted to go fishing. And I said, if I go in the backyard and dig up some worms, then I'm going to hit the hole. So I went in the backyard and I turned over this log that's back there. And just some big night crawlers under there, man. So I put them in a container with some dirt and that's that was the deciding factor is the worms so after last night when we started hooking them rainbows and ran out of worms um, I'm gonna throw right back in there and see what happens I've got like five worms and after that it's over the Sun's starting to go down 8 o'clock 8 p.m. on a Sunday night We got the place to ourselves. Sometimes there's people up there spray painting, but we just leave them people alone. Is there anybody up there? I'm afraid to look. Whoa. Backyard, right under the old log. Okay. It's gonna bite. Man, two worms down. Just thieved them right off my treble hook. These are sharp hooks too. These aren't the cheapos. That's all right. I want the one that's gonna not be able to get away from that hook. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Okay, got him. I got him that time. Come on, baby. You ain't getting no more of my worms. I can dig the other ones out of his stomach. aggressive mm. we're saving up some fish for a fish fry so this one's going home with me oh come on These guys are magicians. They just suck it right off of there. Just, oh my goodness. GoPro, stop recording. Ooh, come back. baby come on that's a good one it feels like a good one yeah jerked his lips off 
come to Popeye. Oh yeah, that was fun. Whew. Get there. That's the fun part about fishing by yourself with no net, holding the camera. Mm. <sighs> oh well, that was fun. That was a decent sized little rainbow there, or a cutthroat. I don't know what it was. It was a trout for sure. Well, bummer. Let's see if I got any worm left here. Oh, I'm stuck up in a tree and all. Nope. Well, he got... Okay, last piece of worm here. Man, I'm bummed. <sighs> Darn it. Okay, let's get some revenge here. Come on, baby. <sighs> well, I'm refreshed. We're gonna call that a night. I'm down to a power bait worm, and it's not doing too well. I haven't had a bite on it at all. Um, I only dug up six worms. Looks like we need to dig up about 15. And we're gonna come back down here tomorrow night and then throw all this together in a nice little video for you and for us. We like to keep these videos too. I'm really excited to see that the fish are becoming more active and um, there's a whitetail snorting at me on the other side of these bushes. Let me check it out. She's not up here anymore. We'll see you tomorrow night. Stupid power bait worm. Not even a bite. Nothing. The fish aren't stupid. Well, what's up? So we're going back to the Flathead River. We're gonna do a final night of fishing. Yep, I'm wearing a tater chip hat. That's right. Mm-hmm. Howdy, partner. So we're gonna go get some worms and we're gonna go back for one final night of the Flathead River. Gavin missed last night, but I showed him the videos of the fish I was catching. Well, it's not the final, we had a whole year. Well, yeah, but we, got, we got to put it together a video and get it out there on the tube, your tube. Not my tube, it's your tube. So love it, like it, subscribe to it. Right, buddy? What do it's you gotta say? It's probably the last video that we're doing on the Flathead River. This is actually Gavin's tube, Gavin and Anna's tube. I'm just like the producer and the editor in chief and the CEO and the CFO. CFO, what's You're the CFO? president. <laughs> I'm your um, employee, basically. <laughs> what, what do you like about making these videos, buddy? Um, I like the fishing part. There you go, me too. That's my favorite part about it. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, let's roll out of here. Yeah. See you down at the river, partner. You gave her that 20? Yeah, I gave, I did. So yeah. you're taking the you bring back your money? Yeah. Shh, I'm, I'm <laughs> stealing my money back from mom. Is that, why do I even have to be quiet about that? Um, well. It's my money. I gave, I did, I did give it to her. Well, yeah, you did work it. You did work it. I worked for it, for it hard. Right, let's go. <laughs> Shh, don't tell mom to go. I'll just put it back in there with extra. You want to show them what we used as a worm cooler? This. <laughs> we got ice worms and ice. Yeah. The lady was like, "What?" Someone's gonna, someone's gonna try to drink out of it. If you need to and, keep your worms fresh, the, just get another pop container. Ice worms, ice. What's that, buddy? If someone tries to drink out of it, the lid pops open and they suck up a worm. Oh. <laughs> Okay, we're at the spot, and whoever's vehicle's parked up there is not here. Maybe they blew up the raft and Oh, God, I love this spot, especially now that we're catching fish. I don't know how deep it is out there, but you can see it drops off 
Gavin's peeing in the river. Jerk. Oh, you do? Can I reel it in? Hell uh, yeah. Here you go, buddy. He's, oh. he's bouncing. Reel him in. God, he's All the battery's gonna die on this thing. Oh, just our luck. I got spares. Spares. Here, reel him in, baby. Woo, baby. Keep that pole tip kind of, yeah, up a little bit more. Okay, when you get him close to the shore, reel him slow. Oh, God, no. Did he get off? Yeah. Yeah, that's all right. Worm feet. Yeah, and you got your worm too. Welcome to the Flathead River, bud. Okay, let's rig up, change batteries. I'm gonna put this thing I on my can't head. The first time you can. Oh, got one. You got a fish? Yep. Yeah, buddy, tighten that bell up a little bit. Gavin got a fishy. I got a snag. <laughs> okay, pull down just a little bit. There you go. Oh, I got a snag too. Okay, nice and easy. Oh, God. Oh, that's a huge one. Okay, nice and easy. Don't, don't. Oh my God, it's a huge one. Nice, buddy. Rainbow? No. Okay, it's something. I think that's cutthroat. Oh yeah. He's got a broken back or something. Go, Buddy, knuckles. That he was biting. Mm. Torture, torture mm. before dying. Okay, okay, string up. It's been attacked by something before. Should we keep it or no? I don't know, buddy. My have feces. Dad. Should we let it go or keep it? We better keep that one. It's humongous. That's a good catch, bro. What is it? It's a cutthroat. It's huge. God. Yeah. He did? Yeah, he's been... We're going to have to cut him open and see what his meat looks like because he's got a really big puncture right there. Almost like he's been shot, but he's probably been attacked by a, a northern pike. would be my first... Suspect. Reel it in a little bit. Did you have a bite? Yeah, I did. Okay, watch your pull. He's coming back. I know it. He's coming back. Mm. We got a ton of bites. These are tricky little turds, huh? Oh, bite. Oh, nope, just one last trickery. And he got my worm. Oh my God. Okay, let's peace out. Gavin's got a tummy ache. Let's go, buddy. <laughs> Can you carry the worms? Yeah. Okay. Oh my God. Nice catch. You gotta go to the bathroom? Yes. Okay, God, let's go. Home sweet home. So we ended up with the one cutthroat that Gavin caught. Put me yeah. in shame. Man, I just kept getting bite after bite after bite, and those things just, I don't know what it is. I'm going to have to do some research. Yeah. But we ended up with a really nice cutthroat that Gavin caught. Yeah. Nice catch, bro. How did it feel reeling that thing in? It felt like it was this long. <laughs> it was almost that long. It was like this. We, we cleaned that fish up. It had a big puncture wound on, on its side where it had been attacked by another fish, but all the meat looks good, so we cleaned it up. We got it in some salt water in the fridge in a Ziploc bag. That's how I do my fish until I'm ready to eat them. And we are gonna smoke these trout fillets and then we are gonna make pickled trout smoked fillets. Smoked trout, smoked pickled trout fillets. We're gonna give it a shot. But that's gonna conclude our Flathead River fishing adventures. From the last few days, we're gonna come pile it all together in a nice little video for you people, for our friends, for your tube. Gavin, you wanna say goodbye to your friends and fans? Um, bye. Make sure to like, subscribe, and we're getting giving away a rod and reel from Snappies at 250 likes. Absolutely, that's correct. We're gonna give away a 
brand new fishing reel and rod from Snappy Sports Center here in Kalispell. Yeah. And when we get 250 um, subscribers, we're gonna randomly select one. And you're gonna, you're gonna have a pretty good chance too because we only have 250 likes. Well, yeah, we, oh yeah, I get what you're saying. Yeah, we have 250 likes on our videos. But when we get to 250 subscribers, one of you is gonna get a brand new rod and reel and we'll ship it right to your house from Forever West Outdoors. Uh, salmon snagging season is right around the corner. We're gonna go up to Eureka, Montana again. And there's a river right through town there that you can snag salmon. So we're gonna go up yeah. and fish with some friends and family up there and we'll put together a super sweet salmon snagging video. Season. Super sweet salmon snagging season coming up from Forever West Outdoors right to your tube. Have a good night.